My name is Yolanta Vishker Apine and I work as a plant quality supervisor in plant in, uh, in Eshtenak. Uh, currently uh, I'm already four years employed at IE and in the beginning I have started as a quality engineer and right now I'm a plant quality supervisor. I was offered this position after one and a half years at IE and in my responsibilities there are 16 people uh, in plant quality team and my main assignment is to coordinate work of the team uh, because we are working um, to ensure that every product leaves um, plant in Ashtonach, confirms to the customer specifications. And um, in general, my team works uh, with processes, with process improvement, um, with audits. We are also responsible for uh, supplied materials quality, so there is plenty to do. Originally, I come from Latvia, where I have studied at Riga Technical University. I have studied there seven years, so it's quite a long <laughs> way to go. In the beginning, I have done bachelor studies in computer science and I also completed engineering uh, studies in the same area, uh, financial IT. But then it was so that I have discovered um, how many different things are in, within manufacturing field and I thought it's an exciting area. And I um, joined master studies, industrial engineering and management. And during my studies I also uh, did participate in exchange programs in, in Delft, um, University of Technology in Holland and also in Royal um, Institute of Technology in Sweden. First of all, I like diversity of my job. Um, I have also chosen area of quality because um, it gives a possibility to work with people, to work with uh, processes, um, to work with different kind of processes because if you are development engineer, you work on development but plant quality or quality in general, it connects everything. So the diversity would be the first thing. Uh, then the second aspect would be tactile results, which you can get um, very, very fast. Um, for example, in case you do educational reform, it takes plenty of years to see the results. In case you change something in manufacturing, you can see it next week. You can see um, benefits of your work. Or if you do something wrong, you also see it very soon. <laughs> And the uh, third thing what I like, um, it is um, in this current position, uh, team leading. I am really, really happy that I have a um, very good team. And it is a challenge for me every day uh, to coordinate the job in a way that people remain satisfied with their work conditions and with the work which I do. And I can organize the teamwork so that we go uh, towards a common goal. One more thing what I really like about the quality is investigation. It's like a work of detective. In case we have um, some process which is not working or which we could improve, or in case we have a customer complaint, uh, we have to understand what has happened and we have to understand either how to repeat it if it was successful or how to prevent it from happening again if it was our failure. In general, I believe uh, that there are plenty of potential which is not used when it comes to women in the technical field. Um, I would recommend to think about the um, future in 10-15 years, where do you want to be? Because currently it is so, I, um, I think what I'm going to study, I think maybe what, I will, uh, what will be my first job, but think about the future in 15 years and think where you want to be. Uh, the area um, of manufacturing or technical field, it's very diverse. You have to learn continuously, you have to um, be up to date, you have to really to um, learn continuously and every day you see a new situation. And I believe that this is very, very challenging and I would really recommend to think about it. It's my personal belief, but I believe that women um, are very suitable for engineering's work um, because of personality. We have to work in teams and women build relationships very, very well. Uh, they are very attentive to the details so it would be the second thing. They are very creative and as one say, they can handle multiple tasks. So this is a precondition for a successful engineer. And in case you believe that this is a pass for you, I believe um, what you have to study is mathematics and especially geometry because that would help uh, you to look at one thing from different perspectives. And it's a very, very good thing if you train your imagination in this way. And also physics because it helps to understand how the world functions.